what's happening guys? Welcome to another episode. Today's gonna to be a real short one. I'm going up to Seabird with a few mates. Um, Seabird, I believe, is like an hour and a half or two hours from Perth near Lancelin. And yeah, it's just like plenty of dunes by the looks of it. So we'll be doing four wheel driving. I think my mate's got a few sup boards. Um, we'll be listening to music and just having a good time on the beach. It's gonna be a hot day, so can't wait. You. All right, so just stopped off. Everyone's having a brekkie. What did you get? Babs, mate. Oh yeah. Bacon egg roll, and I got the breakfast of champions. Chips and gravy. Doesn't look too bad, but the gravy needs to be a bit thicker, if I'm being honest. Anyway, that should fuel me up for a day on the beach. All right, so we just got to the start of the tracks at Seabird. Just gonna let our tires down to about 20. Um, gonna use my deflator. And when you're using this, just a little tip, because I've made this mistake, don't get sand caught in the end, because then it's hard to get over the, the valve. All right, so. Let's let our tires down. It's not me that's bogged, me mate is bogged. So I'm gonna help him out. And if I'm being completely honest, they've already helped me out with a few bogs, so we'll see how we go. All right, attempt number one. Yep, slow, slow. Yep, now I turn and power. And then keep the wheel straight now. Straight, stop, stop. We nailed it, first attempt. Ew. All right, so we've gotten out of that bog, but we only found two ways to get out of this beach. There's one up a rocky track, which is just like steep as. Don't let your dreams be dreams. Yesterday, you said tomorrow. So just do it. Make your dreams come true. Just do it. Mom just had a go and just dented the side of our car. She's pretty excited. She's going to have a go at the more sandy exit of the beach, but that was pretty steep. So I'm a bit, I'm panicking. <laughs> I'm hoping we can get off this beach. Otherwise I might have to just camp on the beach and reassess tomorrow. <laughs> All right, so we've just gotten to the spot that's pretty sandy to get out and we're pretty bogged here. You can see, we're on a bit of a slope too. Jack's just hooked up his winch. He's pretty excited to use it because it's the first time using it. So we'll see how we go. As we can see, the car's just sliding down. Just stop there. All right, so we finally all just got up back to the tracks. Honestly, that took us about an hour and these people like, and their kids were just watching us failing. But no, we're all up now. So we're heading back down the tracks and we're gonna go find a spot to set up and then we'll just hang out on the beach because um, yeah, Seabird's pretty hard sort of, well, it's soft sand, but it's hard to get back up onto the tracks. So you're sort of stuck while you're on the beach. But anyway, it's all good. We'll go find a spot.
we've just been sitting on the beach for the last few hours is bloody magic. As you can see. Um, yeah. It's a beautiful beach, Seabird. There's plenty of fish, it's good temperature, um, not much seaweed, it's pretty clear blue, as you can see. I said I'd show you our camp, so this is our camp next to the train. Got a few swags laying around. Got the gazebo up with the towers for a bit of shade. I don't know if you can see my green sign there, that's the best part. But um, yeah, the girls are just playing Connect Four. Oh, so I block two. Oh, you had another one. Who won? Me. L. Oh, oh, nice. It's a big upset. <laughs> Alright, little update. We're playing Yeah Nah, and where did we get this game on? Uh, I got it from the game shop. <laughs> <laughs> it's a man of YouTube, eh? Right? Yeah, Nat's what I reckon. It's like Nat's his game. Uh, it's like kind of a trivia game that anybody can play because it's got a lot of like chance. Alright, uh, well shout out to him and what's the question, Jack? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Female dragonflies often fake their own death in order to avoid mating. <laughs> Sunset's coming, okay. we're gonna finish this so game, so I'm about right. to lose because we got one more token. Sauce. <laughs> sauce. Means I'm the big loser. Um, That's <laughs> apparently the champion. I was the first one to read. Alright, another little update. We've just moved our deck chairs up to the top of the dunes. What do you reckon there, gang? The best. Not a bad spot for the sunset, so we're just gonna sit here, have a few beers, and just enjoy the atmosphere. Yo, just finished up our night. Sunset was good, dinner was good. And time for bed. Morning people, um, just woken up. Everyone's still asleep, so just come down to the beach for a bit of a look. I don't even know if I'm gonna get wet. It's a bit overcast today, which is good because I got a bit burnt. I don't know if you can sort of see that, but um, yeah, there's people down here fishing and yeah, just gonna enjoy this for a little bit till everyone wakes up and then I'm gonna make some bacon, egg, avocado wraps, and then probably call it. But it's been a wicked trip, so yeah. So just got down here, just sort of walking around, enjoying the beach. It's pretty lovely, as you can see. Um, there's a few blokes over there doing some drone fishing, which is pretty cool. You can sort of just send your drone out and you don't need a boat, so it's not a bad little hack. Don't mind watching that. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to say a big thank you to everyone that's um, liked and subscribed and all that sort of stuff because yeah, lately I've put a few more videos up and yeah, I've got some new subscribers which is good because um, yeah, I'm trying to grow the channel. So yeah, I just want to say thanks to anyone that's watching or liking, subscribing um, or just yeah, leaving a nice comment, really appreciate it because it takes a bit to put a video up, you know, you're putting yourself out there but um, yeah, I enjoy doing it so if people enjoy watching it then um, it's good to hear it. So. Just a thanks and yeah. 
Just got out, actually went for a swim. Can't beat it, eh? I reckon going for a swim in the morning is the best way to wake up. It just refreshes you, feel great, body feels good, nice and limber, ready for a day. I'm probably doing not a lot, <laughs> but um, yeah. The, the video might not do it justice, but um, yeah, it's pretty beautiful. All right, just finished up a swim. Gonna make some brekkie bacon, egg, avocado wrap. Let's go, boy. destroy this thing. Just finished my bacon and egg wrap, it was bloody mint. So I think we're gonna take off soon, so time to pack up. Got the gazebo, chairs, and a few other things to pack away. Then we'll get on the road. gonna have a quick beer at the Seabird Tavern. Pretty, pretty beautiful spot. Looking out to the ocean there, sit on the grass, nice palm tree. And um, yeah, we'll just have one last beer before we go. <laughs> All right, so just got myself a juice instead of a beer. Everyone else, how's your drinks? Good. Good. Yeah. Yeah. Very nice, so I'm gonna call it. Thanks for watching, like and subscribe. See you later.